there are some guidelines uh, that should be followed by uh, every planner so that uh, he can make a better plan effective plan to achieve a predetermined goal uh, in most effective and economical way so in the list we have first principle of purpose every plan is made for a specific purpose and to accomplish that purpose to reach the organizational goal in most effective and economical way every long term plan should be associated with medium term and short term plans and uh, the next principle we have is principle of pervasiveness long term plans are related with top management while the uh, medium term or uh, short term plans are related with middle or operational management where actual work is performed in this way uh, we can see that the planning is everywhere in each level of the management and it is what this principle states now the third principle is principle of limiting factor as we know that industry runs with different factors or resources like main material machine money equipment etc and planner should have consider the limitation of those resources so that planning could give effective result now let's move for a fourth principle and this is principle of flexibility since we know that the future is uncertain the environment is dynamic in nature and because of that the made plan doesn't work always so the plan should be made in such a way that it could adopt the changes it should be flexible enough so that one could make modification if needed apart from changing environment condition there may be some other reasons Uh, which can call for modification like uh, error in forecasting or uh, error in uh, decision making and it will lead to make changes and one can make changes only when uh, the plan will be flexible enough now coming to the last principle principle of navigation change one of the important managerial function is control and by which management makes sure that the uh, things are going according to plan and if something is deviating from the plan and uh, leading us not to reach to the goal as scheduled then it is the responsibility of manager to navigate things to navigate processes in right direction so that we could achieve the goal as per the planning if uh, everything is going as per the plan and uh, because of some unexpected event manager feels that the direction in which we are moving is not leading us to our goal as scheduled then he should change the direction of his plan this is harish kumar patel and you are watching this tutorial on your e studies stay on this channel stay subscribed for more knowledgeable content thank you